What's up guys, Tabby Cats here. Happy New Year. I know I haven't uploaded in a while. Um, we've had some things going on. My dad being out of the hospital for surgery. Uh, or the dental place for surgery. He's had some major dental surgery. He also has had his gallbladder taken out. So he's been in the hospital a bit as well. But uh, welcome back. Today I want to introduce you guys. Everything else is literally the same. The gaming PC. The... Uh, DSC, the 2 gig, everything's the same. But I've taken it upon myself to take in this um, Honeywell right here and uh, um, basically change it into a great system. It had a low backup battery and some faults. So I fixed all of those and have added multiple zones. So this, it also has a uh, dialer which goes to my phone. So we're going to test this, but. Um, for right now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take you guys to a tour. So this is the main control panel, obviously. Disarmed. Ready to arm. So far, all the zones I have added to it, we have living room driveway window. Um, front window one. Front window two. Upstairs hall smoke. And upstairs window one, which is a roof access window. Yeah. So, with that being said, I'm going to take you guys um, downstairs and show you guys how the new system works. Also, before I forget, let me show it to y'all real quick. The system also has a key fob, which we'll also be testing. Where is it at? Gotta leave it upstairs. Hold on a second, guys, while I found it. My bad guys, I found it. It was actually on my desk. So, um, we have away, disarm, stay, and police panic. So, uh, let's go ahead and get on with the test. I guess we can go ahead and start with panics first. Um, since I have the, uh, panel right here. Or the, uh, key fob right here. Let me, um, disconnect the phone line. Uh, so that way it does not dial my phone and interrupt my recording so here we go uh, let's go ahead and start with key fob pan so transmitter police alarm enter our code to silence it not ready to arm as you see it's attempting to dial out but it will not be able to So. Disarmed. Not ready to arm. Press status again. Alarm. Transmitter. Police. Alarm. Alright. Disarm. Or uh, clear the alarm by the code and off. Disarmed. Ready to arm. That is the key fob panic. Let's do fire. Volume warning. Three, two, one. Coding off to silence. System ready to arm. So star. Disarmed. Check. System ready to arm. Fire. Alarm. Fire. Alarm. And our coding off to clear. Disarmed. Ready to arm. Next we'll do police keep keypad panic. Coding off to 
silence. Status. Well, after it finishes dialing. Disarmed. Not ready to arm. Alarm. Police. Alarm. Coding off to silence. Disarmed. Ready to arm. And like I said, guys, in case you forgot, it does dial to my phone, but I'm recording on my phone, so I disconnected it just for the time being. A dialer demonstration will come later in the day. Or uh, later in the series. So let's go ahead and do medical panic and then we will move on to sensors. Code and off to silence. Disarmed. Not ready to arm. Coding off to clear. Disarmed. Ready to arm. Alright, so now we're going to move on to burglary sensors. So we'll do one arming with the fob and one arming with the, or and, uh, other ones arming with the keypad. So let's uh, go ahead and arm the system to stay. Armed. Stay. Exit now. I will come back when the delay is expired. Armed. Stay. So the delay has expired. It is now time to trip a zone. We're going to start with living room driveway window. Alarm, living room, driveway, window. Encrypt silence. Disarmed, not ready to arm. Alarm, living room, driveway, window. Code off to silence. Disarmed, ready to arm. Let's arm it to stay using the keypad. Armed. Stay. Exit now. And we're going to be doing the front windows. I'll be right back when the delay expires. Stay. Systems armed. Let's go ahead and do uh, this window. Alright guys, so we got two more burglary zones to trip. Um, we're going to do front window two and front window, or uh, upstairs window. So, do key, uh, we'll do a key fob or alternate. Armed. Stay. Exit now. Be back when the delay is up. Stay. Alright guys, we're going to do front window two. Alarm. 
front window two. Disarmed, not ready to arm. Alarm, front window two. Disarmed, ready to arm. One more zone. Uh, upstairs window one, and then we'll move on to the fire zones. Armed, stay, exit now. Be back when the delay's up. System is set. We're gonna go ahead and trip uh, upstairs window one. This is like if anyone climbed on the roof or something. go. Disarmed. Not ready to arm. Disarmed. Not ready to arm. Alarm. Upstairs. Window. One. Disarmed. Ready to arm. Alright guys, so let's move on to the uh, fire zone. As of right now, we only have one smoke. Um, so. Let's test the smoke itself first. Okay, guys, so here's the weird thing about the smoke detector. It has two separate sounding uh, tests. Or t uh, sounder tests. So. You can just test this without tripping the panel by pushing in the test button, which I'll do in a second. To test its communication alarm to the panel, you have to take off, you have to twist and take off the base. So, we're going to test the sounder on here individually first. Volume warning. And one, two, three. That's how you test the sounder. Now, we're going to test the system to the panel. So, one, two, three. So guys, that is pretty much it for the Honeywell links. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed. Let me plug the final line back in. There we go. Alright. So also guys, be on the lookout. We have just recently started a Night Owl camera system, so be on the lookout for that. Alright guys, I will see you on the next video. I hope everyone has a safe, happy new year, and I will talk to you then. Leave comments on what I should add to the links next, and I will see you on the next video. Bye!